hey guys, we're out in the brewing area, and it's a little chilly today. You can tell by the long sleeve t-shirt I've got on. I want to say thanks to homebrewtalk.com, sponsor for this segment. Fantastic website. Check it out and join us on some discussions. And it's discussions from that forum that has led to what we're going to talk about today. Well, I don't know about you, but I've got a list as long as my arm of what I want for equipment and supplies for my brewing. And one of the pieces of equipment I would really like to have is my own fermentation chamber. Now I know I could probably convert like an old refrigerator or a couple of them. I could build my own fermentation room. I just haven't had the money to be able to do those yet. But I'm still wanting to brew beer and when it's chilly out here, I got to have something to keep my wort warm during fermentation. So let's just take a look at what I do with my chamber. Here's my fermenter, all snuggled up in its little blankie. It is about 50 degrees here, and that's a little colder than I want to be doing my ales. This is our old stock ale that we brewed last week. And it's an ale, I want to ferment it at about 68 degrees. But it's 15 here and it's cold, so the blankie helps keep the warmth in. But I also need something to help get more warmth in. So, here we are. I've got a heating pad that I have attached to the bottom of the fermenter because heat rises. And that is adding some warmth in here, and I'm able to keep my fermenter at 68 degrees really easily. The blanket on top holds the heat in, so the heating pad is set on low. It works fantastic to keep this fermenter at the temperature I want. I cover everything, including my blowout tube and bucket to catch the mess. But this is what I'm having to do for my fermentation chamber. Now, I've used this heating pad on a number of different fermenters, including I've used it on the plastic buckets. I just tie it around the side. It works fantastic. I've even sat my uh, glass carboys on top of it. it Seem to work really well. So, the discussions have been quite a lot in the forums lately about how do I keep my temperatures up and what do I use and will a heating pad work? Well, let me tell you, a heating pad works great. The blanket is extra to keep the heat in. And your fermentation will be very good. And those yeasts will be very happy when you keep them this nice and warm. <laughs>